podcast with Jenny and it's been so long since we've done one of these. I mean, we uh, we come to 2018 and when I look back in 2017, I remember it's been a while since I did a monthly mail video. Thank you guys for all the love and support that you guys been spreading out. So, I'm just going to go and wrap on into some of my favorite things that I've got last year and early uh, January this year as well. And just a shout out and big thank you to all of your fans out there. You guys are amazing. So I'm just going to go back a little bit to uh, Pipi there. So she's a really adorable cosplayer. And uh, she got me this for, you know, makeup supply. Because every girl needs to have a nice handbag for makeup. This is really cute. She got me and Sachan, a country fan, matching pairs. That's even more adorable. So thanks, Pipi. I really look forward to hosting you in my house again. And uh, if you guys are into the Costa community, obviously you know the names of Yusuf Dela, he's the Costa champion, he went to Chicago last year and uh, he actually got me this cute adorable Mad Boxy figurine. Now, uh, if you guys have noticed, I've done Mad Boxy cosplay twice, so, and I have a habit of collecting figurines of the costumes that I've done. This is <laughs> cute, really adorable and I really love the character. It is the purple version, I've done the red version. So this does make me want to make the purple version of Mad Moxie 2. So maybe, I don't know, I am tempted. Thank you, Samir. Like, you guys have to check out his page. He's amazing, his costumes are amazing. And he does great sculpting work. So this one's from ATA, Samir Bundela. Thank you. Moving on to something really interesting now. You guys love Star Wars because I love Star Wars. And I always wanted to do Princess Leia. And, uh, you know, finding a Leia wig is so hard, super hard. So, a friend of mine, fellow cosplayer, Abdullah, sent me this Leia wig. And I have to tell you, it's the most adorable hair buns ever. Like, so cute. And uh, I did try to make a Leia cosplay, but I failed. So, I it's pending. I am going to make a Leia cosplay. Maybe we'll do a tutorial of it. We'll figure that out. But speaking of wigs... Now this one isn't exactly a gift. It's it's how do I put it? I, I don't I want to sugarcoat it. I took it without permission. <laughs> Let's put it that way. So uh, my cosplay friend, Akansha Sutan, was shopping and she was like, "Hey, look, we what we should I buy?" And I suggested her to buy a certain wig, which I wanted for myself. And when it came, I just took it. I like, "Hey, thank you for the gift." And that would be this uh, Harlequin. Side squad wig from the comics, so you can see it's really cute. And I did wear it this year in January, and uh, it's not a gift per se; it's just a self-proclaimed gift. Thanks, Akanksha. Really appreciate it. You're not getting this back. <laughs> no, <laughs> forget it. You're not getting this back. It's mine now. You know, mine, 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 mine. And let's let's move a little bit forward over here. Now, you guys know I keep running sick. I'm even sick right now while I'm doing this. You haven't noticed. And uh, one thing I like to do is keep drinking tea or coffee and just so that Wooskar X had gifted me this really cute coffee dim mug. It is ceramic. I hate drinking from plastic or metal. So ceramic is something I love and it has a really nice lid. It keeps my tea warm and I'm sipping on it while I'm doing this because I'm thirsty, okay? And uh, it's really nice. I keep it with me in the office all the time. I, it's one of those gifts, right, where you use it on daily basis. Those are the gifts that are the best gifts, I think. And I love this. Thanks, Mr. You guys should check out his cosplay page too. I see a lot of updates coming on. I hear a new costume is coming up, so check that out. And moving on to one of my favorite people. Right? Talking about Kingston. So Kingston sent me a care package where they send me calendars, they send me a table calendar, they send me a notepad. I mean, these guys really take care of you. They do send a care pack or a nice, lovely gift to me all that. So thank you so much. I am using it as see to do my oh wait confidential. No, no, no. To do my daily routine for work. So awesome work. I mean, I run out of notepads every now and then. And then I have to run to the HR and be like, I don't know. So, real life flavor, and I am using it strictly for cosplay. Now, moving on to something I got in the mail. Ah! And this one was sent to me by Skate Tool, that is from the Mahajan. He. Ah, wait, I need to open this. Ah! It's Pikachu! It's, 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 it's a, it's a, it's a Pikachu. Now, I'm just gonna open. 
って。<laughs> okay, I gotta say, this Pikachu it reminds me of the early Pikachu、uh, animation that came out where Pikachu was fat. Like, they reworked Pikachu and then he lost like 20 kgs or something. But this is the classic version of Pikachu and it is cute. And、uh, I'll, I think I'll keep it in office in one of our shelves over there because、uh, I have it. Okay, so、uh, speaking of Pikachu, I love Pikachu, I love Pokemon, it's one of my favorite anime series, and so Pokemon is pretty much what got me into cosplay. So it's close to me. Speaking of that, you guys know about Super, right? Manoj Gola? I hope I'm saying your name right. He also got me this Pikachu shirt, so Pikachu Overdose. And I've done Pikachu cosplay like twice or three times, I'm not even, I don't even have a count. And I plan on doing more Pokemon cosplay this year, so. Love this is this is from the Psycho Store, so awesome shit. Hashtag not sponsored, hashtag could be sponsored, just saying. And、uh, moving on to this item over here, a little more of a girly stuff. I'm not sure.、Uh, when I was in college, I used to do a lot of nail art. Like, I was I was the girliest girl you can imagine. I had my hair done, I would wear the pretty, pretty dresses, high heels. That was before the cosplay days, okay? Don't judge. And、uh, one thing I used to do is nail art. So, this is.、Uh, I haven't opened it yet. The nail art kit that I've received、uh, from Wolfstar X, and、uh, I have to try it. So, I'm not sure if you guys can see it right now. I'm just gonna take one, like the different ones here. The, these. What you do is basically, I'm gonna remove the peel off here. I'm not gonna show you how to use it because I don't have nail paint on me right now. But I am gonna tell you how you do it. First, you remove the protective film over here, and then you see these engravings, right? So、you put your nail paint onto this and、uh, you use the scraper, you scrape it out, and then using this little stampy thingy, you transfer it into this and then onto your nail. You guys have seen those nail beauty you know, videos on everything, and that's how you do it simple. So, this is super cool. I think I'm gonna use them, try them, put a picture out on Instagram and on Facebook. What do you guys think? Should I do that? Does it count as cosplay? I don't know. Nail cosplay? Tell me in the comments below. And I'm、uh, moving on to the last gift. Now, this is something I actually really love because, as a cosplayer, makeup is an important part. And I got this from Work Office Summit. All of these contestants got a gift like、uh, the same one. It's Dolly Cosme Liquid Foundation. Now, I'm just gonna open it and show you. The liquid foundation, the base color is fairly white. It's my skin tone. So, I love that. Finding my skin tone is kind of hard for me. But that's not the reason I love it. The reason I love it so much is because it comes with these three additional formulas. These are also foundations that you can use. And what you can do is actually, I'm g o i n g to open this up.、Whoop. You can、uh, use them to change the color of this foundation. So it comes in three shades vanilla, whip, and chocolate. So, a lot of different characters have a lot of different skin tones, and you can't just run around buying different, different foundations because makeup is expensive. So, these are lightsaber. If I want to do maybe black facing, a lot of people, you know, they don't like black facing, they think it's racist, they think it hurts culture. Me, I think if I'm doing a character, for example, Storm, I want to do Storm for my f r i e n d for ages now. And if I'm doing a character like Storm, I want to black face myself. Not because, you know, I, I'm racist or I, I think, you know, skin color matter. The reason being, Storm was one of the first black African American superhero that, you know, I grew up as a childhood and I don't want to take away from that from her. So I think I am going to be using and testing this and maybe I'll do a tutorial for it and、uh, I'll make a Storm costume because this is really encouraging me. I've been really scared about it because of the backlash. A lot of my cosplay friends tell me, don't do it. Some say, go ahead. So, I am gonna do it. I'm gonna go with my gut feeling. You guys can think it's racist and black facing is wrong. I think I'm doing it for the character and I will try this up. So, again, it comes in four shades. You can take the little one, the vanilla. It's really great because if you wanna do like a vampire look or a pale dead one, this one will turn you white. Then there's the whipped cream, which is a little tanned texture, and the chocolate one, which you know, is a little more rough on the brown、uh, skin tone. So, those are the gifts I got so far, and、um, it's just amazing the amount of love and support you guys just throw at me. So, thank you so much, and I'd like to take this moment to thank my patrons, which is、uh, 
Abdullah, well, thank you so much. We have Tom and we have one new latest patron that just signed up last night. Al Tuhina Ji Banerjee, thank you so much. You three have been supporting me and I really look up to putting more content out. You guys, if you love this, subscribe to the channel. Cosplay Genie brings out tutorial. We try to help cosplayers. Let me know what you want to see in the comments down below. Like this video and do check out the other videos that's on the channel. This is Kalmyar and signing off and Cosplay Genie will see you again with another tutorial.